Uh, it's been an adventurous afternoon. I'm stuck in the car now with the motor off. I don't want to have the noise, so I might start sweating. Long story short, <laughs> I, I let the uh, horse, my big horse lie go in order to catch something more interesting, which I'll end up letting go. Um, I just don't, I just don't have any need to. Yeah, if I catch one of those really big horse flies. Anyway, I found a, a really amazing stick insect. Have a look at this. Look at this thing. Oh man, I'm sweating now. Ah, oh, I've never seen, it's almost got the uh, tail. It moves fast, it really, really moves fast. The tail curls up like a uh, scorpion sting. But I'm sure that's not what it is. Let's go out here. Let's see if it'll come out and pose for us on my dashboard here. I'm gonna lift that tail up. Look at that. They're very large uh, stick insects. Are Japan has some amazing ones. This is not as big as I've seen. There we go. Come on, lift that up. Lift that. The insects have three body segments, head, thorax, and ad abdomen. The he head, of course, has the head, <laughs> sensory organs. Thorax has the uh, three sets of uh, legs, you can see the three sets there. And the abdomen has the uh, internal organs, the digestive organs, reproductive organs there in the back. Now what I want to do is catch, it's catching up, I can't quite get it now anymore, it's too high. It'll really, it'll jump and run fast if I, if I startle it. I don't want to hurt it. Look at that, climbing up towards my head. Look at those legs, those joints, wow. Close relative we are, yes, 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 with those, those limbed animals that we are. There we are, you jumped down there, didn't you, on my camera bag. Let's see, I can bring those uh, two legs up and hold them forward. Let's see if we can zoom in enough without losing focus. Bring that, here, let's bring that abdomen up. I know you can do it. Oh, I'm dripping sweat onto the camera. That's gross. Yes, walking stick. And of course, they don't use it. That is a, a fact. It's a cam form of camouflage. I've never seen one quite like this. They vibrate like that to look like they're a stick moving in the wind. That's kind of. I gotta turn the motor on for just a second. I'm sorry. I'm literally look at look at this. I'm literally I'm I'm I'm, I'm bathed in sweat. <laughs> right there, it's lifting this abdomen up, curling. Get the camera on that hurt. See it's starting to curl. It does kind of look like it has a little, little caudal cerci, I think that's what they're called. Pinchers at the end. I don't know. Kind of like I wish I, wish I had a good macro camera I could really zoom in. It's definitely curling it though. When I first saw it, it was really curled up. And is that about uh, being? Let's see how it's brought the four front legs forward like that to make it elongate its body like that. I'm reading a book right now. Your inner fish. Talking about uh, the part I'm reading right now is talking about the similarity between uh, basically limbed animals, creatures that, that have fins, legs, arms, wings, things like that, and the astonishing similarity, the scientific enterprise to determine what genes were responsible for the uh, formation of limbs in various animals as diverse as flies, fish, mice, and human beings. Turns out the similarities are are astonishing. <laughs> it's basically it's basically uh, one and the same mechanism, with of course uh, different patterns of the gen of the genes. I'm sorry, I'm holding the camera straight. Okay, you're not going to do that, are you? You've kind of brought yourself your body in close and tight. Now let's get you to move a little bit. Let's see. Here we go. There you go. There you go. There you go. Uh, now you're curling up. Where are you going now? I want to cross under my key, under my backpack. 
What an astonishing creature. It has antennas. You can see the long, long antenna there. there. Now it's situated. Now bring that bring that abdomen up. We're gonna hold off. If you're not if you're not a diehard bug fan, I guess you can leave when you want. If you're a diehard bug fan, we're gonna hold off until we can see that abdomen swing up. It looks just like a scorpion when it brings it up. you wait. I couldn't turn the camera off now. I'll turn it back on when it brings it up. We'll wait. It's moving. Oop. It jumped off and it's laying upside down now. <laughs> Get on my hand. There you go, there you go. There you go, sticky insect. There you go. I'm going to turn it off until I can get it in that position. And then I'll show you guys, okay? Here we go. Off. Or slides are back.